Greetings and Happy New Year, APW family. I hope you and your families had safe, healthy, and enjoyable holidays. Peak season is hard on postal workers, but also highlights the wonderful mission of the Public Postal Service and the great value of our work as postal workers. Last year was a remarkable year for our union. Among many gains, we ratified a dynamite new union contract, passed historic postal reform legislation, won thousands of new career positions, and signed up 5,000 non-members in our building union power organizing drive. Our union democracy was in full display at our August National Convention and October National Officer elections. The new year will be full of challenges and opportunities. Together, we must better address the ever-increasing hostile work environment, and we'll fight to win safe and adequate staffing at every postal facility. We will continue the fight to preserve and expand our democratic rights in the face of rising voter suppression and authoritarianism. Expanded vote by mail is key. We'll focus on protecting our jobs and defending and expanding service as management pursues their network realignment plans. We'll continue to organize the unorganized, growing the labor movement. We will be fully engaged in promoting pro-worker, pro-union, and pro-postal legislation. And we'll continue to build grassroots power as we prepare for contract negotiations next year. I encourage all of you to get involved or stay involved in your union this year. Attend union meetings, sign up a non-member, wear union gear with pride, join a union committee, stand in solidarity with all workers and stay union strong all year long. For you, the members are the key to our success. Onward in unity and solidarity. And again, Happy New Year to one and all.